Another hair review. So this wig I'm sporting today, guys, is from RPGHair.com. Now, initially when I opened the box, they did send me two wigs, and I reviewed one a few weeks ago, and then I'm reviewing this one today. So I didn't even look to see like the specs correctly until now. Now, I, when I first got this unit, I kind of looked at it, and I was like, wow, this is a really thick density. When I usually get these curly units, they're about like 150% density, 130, just because some companies feel like because it's curly, it's gonna be big, and you don't have to emphasize the thickness too much. So this one is actually 180% density guys and straight out the pack when I saw it I was like damn this is some really nice big hair now I never wet my hair on video sometimes I'll just uh, take it straight out the box and kind of like comb it out so this time when I decided to do for this video is wet the hair so you guys can see what the hair looks like when it's, when it's wet and when it's dry so I basically wet as much as I can around the unit and mostly a lot in the front I did get the back a little bit but not as much as the front I really like this hair guys. Now I'm not really someone that likes a lot of kinky textured hair but this one is really nice. So this one is Brazilian Virgin um, Water Wave 360 wig. It's a high quality pretty curly hair. It's 20 inches long and it's 180% uh, density. Now I kind of don't consider this a water wave. I consider this just kind of like curly hair or kinky curly hair. So that's what I'm going to call it. Um, I do really like it guys and like I said initially when I tried it on in the beginning of the video I was like yo this hair is actually pretty thick. So now that I look at it the hair is very very thick guys and it is pre-plucked in the front so the company did a really good job with that. So I didn't have to do a lot with this unit guys. The only thing that I did was cut the baby hairs and glue them down just around the perimeter like I usually do. I re <laughs> like you guys can see look at how buff this is and I even went back there and tried to comb it out add some more water in it just to kind of like make it more of a defined curl. Um, like I said I usually don't do that in my videos I'll just take the wig out the box take a white tooth comb and like comb it out but I wanted to show you guys what the hair looks like when it's wet so you guys aren't kind of like misled thinking that you know the pattern's gonna stay. Uh, the pattern actually did stay though. It's just a little bit more kind of like spread out a little bit uh, compared to, let's see if I can find one hidden piece back here that's still curly. So for example, this hidden piece back here is still in its ringlet style um, and obviously the front is kind of looser. I do like the loose version of this just because it has more of a realistic look. I just put a little bit of water and a little bit of argan oil in the bottle and mixed it together. I didn't use any of the curling cream products just because I didn't feel like this type of texture needed that. Um, I use those products, the Cantu products on curly hair that's softer and that's like a really light curl just because that curly hair tends to frizz up more than this does. Because this one has more of a kinky texture, when it frizzes it looks more natural. On soft curly hair when it frizzes it just looks a mess so I use a Cantu on kind of like light curly hair. Um, for this one I didn't have to add anything. I think it just came perfect. It's very very nice guys. It's 20 inches long but obviously when it's in curl form it stops like right above my breast. Um, I feel like stretch length that would come under my boobs but I'm not going to straighten this just because I like the simplicity of the style and the whole purpose of buying a unit that's curly is to wear it curly but I understand that everybody has money to buy like multiple wigs so if you want to straighten I'm pretty sure it'll straighten pretty fine now this is a 360 unit guys so you get about four parting four inches of parting space in the front and two in the back so if you want to do like a high bun high ponytails you can do whatever you want so guys I will leave all the information down below if you're interested in purchasing this baby or any other baby from this website I will link the last video I did on their yaki straight wig somewhere up here for you guys if you guys want to check that out that video was very detailed and very descriptive when it came to um kind of like styling the wig, putting it down, baby hair magic and all that kind of stuff. So if you want to check that out, I'll leave the link up here for you guys. Now guys, do not forget to thumbs up this video, leave your comments down below, subscribe and share this video with your friends and family, people, and I will catch you guys in a later one. Bye!